beautiful morning. Today you join me off Shoreham and it's going to be a scorcher today. It doesn't look it at the minute, but later on it's going to hit 20, 25 degrees. So it's going to be a warm one. Tide's out at the moment. I'm literally launching at the um, Shoreham Lifeboat Centre. And uh, all the fishing boats are heading out at the moment. The board has been released in the lock in the harbour. We've got a short little paddle here just to get out the harbour entrance and then I don't know what to fish for today if I'm honest with you. Today was a bit of a last minute decision to come out here. I didn't plan to come out here. Originally I was gonna go to Selzy. So it's um what's it now? It's May, May time. I've never fished for them in May. It's normally I normally fish this sort of March, April time, and try and catch some place. Um, so yeah, I've never fished May. Uh, we'll see. I've um, got some uh, squid, mackerel, and some really tiny blueies with me today. So I'm hoping there's some rays out there. I've never really caught any rays off Selzies. So, I mean, Shoreham. Never really caught many rays off Shoreham, so. We'll see, but yeah. Anyway, let's paddle out. Oh, looks like there's another car going out here today. Not just moving. The water's clear. Very, very clear today. Very clear. Gin clear. Morning. Alright. So I'm just like trawling my way back this way from being drifted over. Oh, okay. No fishing involved, just like, Just literally dra yeah. dragging it, yeah. I came up and hit the bottom of the boat while I was paddling. <laughs> <laughs> there one. I'll get out of your way. Yeah, definitely. Well, enjoy. I think I'm going to trawl some strips of squid for now. Let's see what we can get. My first setup then, I've just got a two hook flapper on, just with a bit of squid like that. I'm just going to drag that along the bottom. For now. Get some feathers out. We have our first inquiry. What's it gonna be? It's a little place. They're still here. Cute little guy. 
<laughs> so you have a look at him. Nice little place. Only a baby, but they're still here in May. Still here in May. Be back, mate. There you go, saved a blank. Nice little place. Just proves you. Oh, let's get you in here before I talk. Just proves you don't need uh, you don't need worms. So a little bit of squid. Hopefully, some dustbin lids about. That'd be nice. That would be nice. So it's a bit overcast at the moment, but I know the forecast is going to be 25 degrees, so it's going to be a hot one today. I haven't even got the top of my wetsuit on. I've just got a rain jacket, so when it gets hot, I can take it off. We've got a bigger one. Nice place that. Very nice place. Very nice. Check you out, mate. Check you out. Check him out. He's a lot bigger. Nice place. Very nice place. Let's put him back. Check him out. He's a bit bigger. All right, let's get him back in. Straight down. Straight down. Squid's doing the business. I'm going to try some mackerel strips now. So I find the best part is the silver bit on the belly. Just like that. Literally just like that. Thing is, it's such nice weather. I'm gonna get the drone out. I haven't anchored up yet. I was going to anchor up and go for some um, some rays, but I feel I'm going to wait until the tide starts moving a bit and then use the tide to go to a place that I want to anchor up and then drop the anchor and get some big baits out. But while there's no tide and we're just bobbing about, I quite like drifting for things like place and that. So, yeah, having fun. This weather is gleaming, absolutely gleaming. I think no matter where you are in the UK today, you'll be having a good day. Oh, oh. 
Good luck, Bree. It's all right, mate. Of a black bream. It's not what I'm after. <laughs> Still nice to catch one. Still nice to catch one. We're starting to get a bit of tidal movement at the moment. Either that or it's the winds picking up, but. We haven't really been moving much, it's just been bobbing around all morning. I've had a couple place, a few bream, nothing really to shout home about. But it's not a blank, so can't complain. And I managed to get the drone out, which is a good thing. That was, uh, that was good fun. Baby, but from the little place. So I've anchored up now, but I'm getting absolutely pestered by bream. Literally just stripping my baits. So yeah, need them to go away so we can catch the big stuff. They're literally, as soon as my bay hits the bottom, they're literally just stripping it. Just bang, 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 gone. Whole squid gone in about two minutes. I picked these up yesterday, little blueies. I don't know if you can see me with the sun, but yeah, little bluey. I'm gonna use them as bait now. Just gonna fish it like that. There you go. It's a bit better. That's a bit better. Look at that. That's a nice bream now. Huh? Yeah, I don't mind catching bream when they're a bit big like this, because they give a hell of a little fight. Check him out. All right, matey boy. Should we put you back? Should we put you back? He's off. All right, well, they're getting a bit bigger, so that's good. I think that's pretty much the story of the day so far. It's just getting absolutely annihilated by Bream. Yeah, I don't know what to do. I don't know where to move out. I might go back to drifting just with one rod. Ah, we'll see. When I start to run out of bait, I'll, um, I'll probably just drift. Try and catch some more place. Yeah. Literally just stripping it. Come on. Where's the razor? Foul hooked bream. Come on, mate. Decent size. Definitely getting bigger. It's not the bass I thought it was, but. Hey, mate. All right. And he's off. Let's 
for this. This one feels like it's got a bit of size to it as well. Unless it's just more and more bream. I think I've got two bream on at once. Another bream. Another bream. So many of these things. Calm down, mate. Cool. Well, be a good day. Lovely weather. Just got plagued by bream today. I've run out of bait. I've had my place, obviously bream. Um, I had a doggy, and that's about it, really. Um, yeah. Great day though. Lovely weather. It's unfortunate I couldn't catch that ray, but there's always next time. And uh, Selzy's probably going to be my next bet, and I'll probably go there in June, in a couple of weeks' time. So yeah, hope you enjoyed watching, and uh, I'm off to a barbecue, and I'll see you on the next episode. Let's go home.